Hey guys, this is Sam, and today we're taking a look at the redesigned app switcher in iOS 9. As you guys can see right off the bat, the stock app switcher in iOS 9 looks quite a bit different than it did in iOS 7 and 8. However, the functionality is pretty much identical. You can swipe left and right to view all the apps that you've used recently, but there is yet to be a way to clear all apps at the same time. I've tried tapping on app cards, I've tried to swipe down on many, I've tried to hold down on the home card. For whatever reason, Apple just does not want to include a feature to close all apps at the same time. That is one Android feature that I wish could somehow sneak its way into iOS. However, you might have actually noticed that one feature introduced in iOS 8 is now actually gone in the very first iOS 9 beta. And that's the ability to view contacts in the app switcher. So I apologize if you're one of the three people that actually liked that feature, it's gone in iOS 9. Now, sorry to be a little hard on that. And if you did like it, that's totally fine. I just never got the point of it. So I am extremely happy to see that it's gone in iOS 9. And guys, that's about all I have to say about the redesign app switcher in iOS 9. Not a whole lot has changed. The only feature that was actually removed is once again those contacts that used to show above the app switcher cards. For more content on iOS 9 including new features, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And if you did enjoy watching this video, you are more than welcome to leave a like while you're down there. This has been Sam with iDidOS, and I will talk to you guys in the next one.